and how will Azerbaijan navigate this very tense and now quite dangerous neighborhood? Mm. Well, neighborhood, of course, can be a problem and can be an advantage. It depends on your policy and on relations with the neighbors. I think for every country, relations with the neighbors should be a priority, uh, especially in our region. Uh, in Azerbaijan, we do not have uh, internal risks and threats. Therefore, we must also guarantee security on our borders. And the best way is to establish uh, very pragmatic and very sincere relations with your neighbors based on your national interests and based on the understanding of the national interests of your neighbors. I think that uh, in Azerbaijan we managed to establish such a partnership and with all our neighbors except uh, Armenia, which continues to occupy almost 20% of our territories, Azerbaijan has very good relations. Uh, with the neighbors across the Caspian, with Kazakhstan, Turkmenistan, with Georgia, Turkey, Iran, and Russia, and with every country of our neighborhood, we have a very special format of cooperation. Our independence is young, only 26 years of independence, but I think Azerbaijan managed to establish itself as a truly independent country, which can afford to conduct independent foreign policy, policy which is based on our national interests and which is not against uh, interests of our neighbors. So I think uh, for a country which is smaller than most of its uh, neighbors, important is to find this proper balance and to uh, get advantage of the neighborhood because uh, big neighbors means big markets. And for us, uh, the best market is the market of our neighbors. <coughs> Therefore, uh, mutual interests, balance of interests, of course, non-interference into internal affairs of each other, and very pragmatic, practical approach on cooperation in the neighborhood, I think one of the reasons for success of our country, one of the reasons of uh, internal stability, and good prospects for the future. Prime Minister, it's been 10 years now since Georgia's war.